This week on Red River Outdoors, we're fishing off the coast of Texas with Double H Guide Service for spotted sea trout. River Outdoors is brought to you by Thopthaco Deer Camp. Habitat Plus, Wildlife Habitat Improvement. Boonies Outfitters, Hunting Tactical Outdoor Gear. Well, we went down to uh, Port O'Connor, Texas, and uh, did some coastal fishing. Uh, we actually did some wade fishing with Double H Guide Surface, Captain Mike and uh, his son, Bo, took us out, and we went probably 15 minutes from the landing. First time uh, I've ever been invited down on a wade fishing trip. It's the first for me, a little bit different than uh, traditional bass fishing or crappie fishing uh, that we've been doing up here in uh, North Texas and Arkansas. My first time I've ever been to Port O'Connor, of course. Geographically, it's in between Galveston and Corpus Christi. Sunrise on the coast in that, uh, in that first morning was just really breathtaking. Nice, cool when we first went out, and of course, then it, then it heats up. And, and the oil in the bait fish that they ate, it comes to the top. Oh, okay. And so, so that's, you that's see a piece about. that's an oil slick kind of. Oh, okay. And so uh, that's what you kind of look at. But sometimes it could be gaff top, because they do the same thing. Okay. And you pull in, and ain't nothing but gaff top. But, but, you know, hopefully uh, it's, it's trout that we're looking for. And we come through here a while ago and we, uh, we spotted a couple of float out slicks, we call them. A, a fresh slick, but it just comes up and be small. But as the wind hits and it disperses, it's, it's huge. Uh -huh. Well, it's kind of an old slick. Uh, okay. You know, the fish were there a couple of minutes ago. And, but they still may be in there. We're going we're gonna to look. I say a little bait jumping, so we're looking better. Yeah, there, All we do is get out and try. And when I come out, I, I have him pointing towards me here. So all I've got to do now is just take my hook and hook him in a proper spot, which is right there above the anal pin. And then you're on. All right, where's my fishing pole? I 
I've had the chance to wade fish several times. Normally, we just walk in off the, you know, off the land though, and we have been to that area fishing probably 10 times, Port O'Connor, that's why I wanted, wanted to go back. Uh, many years ago, the state had a ferry that went across the Matagorda Island and they would let you out. You could take a tent and all that kind of stuff and then you could walk in and wade fish and duck hunt out, you know, things like that. But the ferry isn't running anymore. So I'm familiar with that area and I knew it was a real good fishery. So that's why I wanted to go back there and I got in touch with Captain Mike and, you know, we went from there. 